Raven Data Collection. Uh, we're here for Game Underground. Welcome to the Road from Time West of Raven And we're going to have a great time. If you can hear me over this incredible music, we will have a great time. I want to give a shout out to the John Watson on Twitch right now. Uh, because you are a part of the world. It's like all of you are robots. Uh, but I know that this is a whole lot of fun.
thank you to everyone who just joined our stream. I'm going to emphasize, I know next to nothing about this game, but I'm going to be doing commentary, so it'll be fun. But you'll be uh, the best Titan guy ever. Is yeah, be the best Titan guy in the world. Yeah, absolutely. Probably. Uh, do we have another chair? I have a chair. Okay, yeah. Hey, we're being joined. Can we just off down a little bit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go for it. We're going to be joined on commentary now by uh, Game Underground owner, uh, James. What's up, guys? Hey, it's gonna be great. There's some Titans falling on the screen. I am, I am at the Titanfall launch right here at the Microsoft Store in the Woo! Oh my god, I can't believe the Game Underground dropped if you on Wilson Road in New York, Massachusetts to bring you Titanfall action live from the Game Underground Store in Natick, Massachusetts at the Natick Collection. That's awesome. No, no, we're in the Microsoft Store. Microsoft Store, what did I say? Yeah, you said the Game Underground no, Store. No, I said, no, that's not what I said. Did I? No, I don't know. We're live here! I don't think that's what I said, but okay. <laughs> at the Microsoft Game Underground Arena. Yeah, Microsoft Game Underground Arena. Yeah, so you can look at our pretty faces instead. Yep. Look at all the people who came out to play Titanfall. They are rocking here. He's rocking out. They don't even know they're on camera, which is good. I don't oh man. Kid is rocking. There's no camera for us. That's okay. Get yeah, webcam. Yeah, click that one. It's okay. No big deal. It's all good. Uh, you should click that you one. You see, there's tons of people here. Other segments in fun. Yeah. Oh no no, GCW. <laughs> what? <laughs> There's no GCW tonight. That was worth the entire <laughs> coming out here for. Well no, we knew that was gonna happen if I clicked it. Exactly out. right. Woo. That's all I wanted. <laughs> Best to remember. Okay. So it looks like we're gonna be going to another game next. Uh, we're gonna see some Titans falling. It's gonna be great. Another, another interesting thing about this game is the map design. I heard that the map design is very unique to any other game ever made. Yep. Um, I've heard it's very open. Yeah, it's, it's, right. it's a much yep. more open environment with more places that you can explore because of the parkour aspect of the game. Oh, and you started. Don't jump out of planes! Oh, oh you also get a jetpack, which is worth mentioning. Yeah. So, jetpacks, parkour, robots. Uh, we are not. This is Titan you see that? Right there. He's got to jump back. You're running up the walls like the beginning of a 007 movie in this game. Oh Whoa! <laughs> Parkour, right? So this is sick. You know what? This is the I played the beta Morse for a while. Computers. This is my first time. I've been trying to avoid actually oh, watching too it. much footage. <laughs> I don't want to... Uh, to spoil the game pre-release too much, you know. I know some yeah, people get hyped. Yeah, I, I have that. intentionally avoided spoilers, so this will be a first impression thing for me. It's pretty great. Yeah, it's pretty good. I'm impressed so far. The environment looks beautiful. See that? Oh, I'm... eat it! That guy's oh, dead. Not. The oh, is fast. I bet that guy is mad because he's bad right now. So how about so. these sick beats, though? I have a headache. <laughs> Matt is tired. They're they're pretty sick. So uh. You can see we're here they're in the so mall. They're so sick, they're making me sick. Exactly, I have a staff infection right now. Oh my god. Shut up, Kevin Nash. I hope that he... Oh. So we got uh, a... <laughs> it's pretty cool. The, the difference, the main difference you see in this game in Call of Duty, there's tons of stuff, but uh, there's oh. definitely... Oh, 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 he shot the other guy. Go, 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 see oh, that? Got him. Turn the rest, got him. See that guy? This guy okay. is holding <laughs> this is the guy that we want to watch. Look at this. It looks like he's found the enemy spawn. And he's, oh, uh, and he's dead. Oh, he's it, it lasted for a little while there. He was on a run. Community 452 is the MVP of this game so far. Okay, so he's respawned. We're going to go get him. Okay, good, good. Wait, I'm going to make you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, great. We got the live stream going on. No, hey, you want to come see? Nice. So, uh... Yep. It's lucky that we can't have any dead air on here, because anytime we don't talk, we'll just hear the music. <laughs> and also while we're talking. <laughs> oh, my God. So, yo, see the people right here? I'm scared of it. I don't hear music. I just see vlogs from ads right now. So like he's on like the third story here already. Oh, here's another Oh, he's a Titan. I've seen a station. Okay. I've seen
see all the music. So is this uh, which Titan is this game? I heard there are three Titans. There are different Titans. Yep, there there are there is Strider, uh, there is uh, Ogre, and then there is third Titan. Which one was that one? Uh, I think that you should stop asking me specifics about this okay, game. Okay, that sounds fair. I'm just calling them all the earth and they will fall down. It's true. They're gonna okay. fall everywhere. Uh, I'm hoping maybe a little bit later we'll get an expert uh, on the scene. I, I really hope some of this watched live stream of this for like 17 hours. We got a. Oh, look at this! All the oh, titans are battling! Oh, oh! It's like Battle Bots, but there's no Chris Jericho! Oh! Oh, look oh, what happened! Look at this! The Titan fell! Oh. I think the Titan fell right on him. The Titan fell on him and crushed him. This guy reached far beside the last of us! That's, that's oh, sick. Oh my god! It was, uh. So you can actually try to do that. No, he has uh, anti-Titan weapons here. Oh damn! Um, you have two types of weapons. Some are better against the Titans. Oh, wow. Some are better against guys on the land. So, uh, what? Basically, uh, the situation you're in, different weapons work better. Right? Uh, I, I, yeah, I that know. makes sense. You gotta get a touch down so, when you should get a. <laughs> yeah, that makes, uh, how effective are, uh, as far as killing Titans, uh, is trying to make them swallow a stone that they think is their firstborn son? Uh, it's pretty good. My, my preferred way of killing Titans is to put anti mutagen in a donut and trick them into eating it. Oh, that's amazing. And then go to a vanilla ice concert while they burp. I mean, is the traditional pre fight donut? It's the traditional pre fight donut. These Titans gotta be careful. They're gonna end up locked in a bit of cargo forever and maybe organized like that. So, what's very sick? What happened a minute ago? Oh, oh, whoa! Parkour! If you are jumping at the walls, you can actually. Uh, run or double jump up the walls or off the side and stuff like that, yeah. which is pretty sick. Um, oh yeah, enemy type, this guy's gonna take on Titan with the same Titan weapon. Oh! He thought the Titan would fall, but he was the one who fell. <laughs> Got him. Wait, 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 that's you. Alright, so he's got the Titan fall. You can tell it where you want to drop it. Oh, that Titan's just, got sick! You can see that? He just dropped that right there. He's trying to get it on him, but he just missed it. Oh, and then he got in. And now you're in the freaking thing. Oh, 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 oh. Right, so now you're fighting the other guy. Oh my god, this is awesome. Another Titan is attacking you. Caution, you are outnumbered two to one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit up on, uh, on some oh, internet sharing here. So if you're watching the stream, please tweet out our stream. We'll get some more people in here. Yeah, it's gonna be awesome. Oh, that guy's Titan's that Titan fell. Oh, man. Oh, man. Hey, oh, man. 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 For those of you who are just joining us, this is Titanfall live at the Microsoft Store in the Native Collection. Uh, we are I'm uh, sorry, Titanfall. Wow. Uh, we are screaming. We are from Game Underground. Welcome to Almost the Road. We're going to West Green, Massachusetts. Uh, and we're going to have a whole bunch of fun stuff going on on the stream for the next couple hours. So, um, this is the launch event for Titanfall at the Microsoft Store. We have people playing this game for the first time. So, these are new players who are trying things out. And uh, for me, this is my first time seeing the game as well. Uh, I'm joined on commentary. Uh, my name is Ryan. I'm joined on commentary by Matt. And uh, Game Underground's owner, Jamie, is right here. He's uh, feeling like he's getting himself what's up, the game. I'm doing that whole uh, internet sharing. He's doing, this, he's doing the social media. Which I am social media. You can do that on your Xbox One, which is what this game is for. So that's pretty good. You can share all of your fun tweets in game on the uh, on the social media and tell all of your friends on the Twitter and the Facebook and everything else. It's gonna be pretty sick. Yeah. Sure. Uh, yep. And we're gonna actually, uh, Jamie's gonna take a break for a second. We're gonna be joined on stream by the. Uh, Joe, I don't know if you have a preferred uh, handle. JJ McCheese. Uh, Retro Joe. It's a bad handle. Oh, Retro yeah. Joe is fine. Retro Joe here. I'm the yeah. resident expert what, having, what played, uh, having played 10 minutes of Titanfall. I'm the resident expert here. So exactly. we're going to take a look at what's going on here. So you can tell when you get killed by an actual person because the grunts are pretty mindless. They run around. They're pretty easy fodder. But uh, that guy got sniped right behind. So he's going to take a look at Oh, now we're just looking at I, I love the dropship element in this game. It seems really cool. Yeah, it really, uh, I like when they're, when you're done with a match, it's part of the end game, you go off the drop tip pressure point. It really adds a little bit of, uh, salt to the wound. Alright. 
Well, if there's one thing we expect from this game, it's sold, I'm sure, because uh, <laughs> you all know how people are on the Xbox Live. Well, you know, I've, I've, I've heard some of the regular Call of Duty players, the people who are used to corridor shooters, really don't like, what, what they don't like about this game is how open it is, how chaotic it is. Right. And somebody to me, uh, somebody like me who's more of a, uh, I, I play a little bit of everything, I'm not as much an FPS guy, yep. I love this. There's so many different things you can do, you can run off the walls, yeah. you can jump on the Titan, you can tell the Titan to do its own thing and just run around shooting people, there's a lot going on. And I think the parkour element really adds a lot of uh, dynamic uh, movement that you don't see in the cover-based tactical corridor shooters. Yeah, no, absolutely. And someone who comes from the same, same deal where I'm not really someone who plays first-person shooters that often, this game has enough unique stuff in it that I'm definitely looking at this and being like, man, I should really give this game a shot. And keep in mind, those are great games. I'm just saying it's nice to see something different that mixes it up a little bit. You know, yeah, regardless absolutely. of whether or not it's going to be the next Call of Duty, it's a different offering that offers something kind of fun. It's and definitely, it's cool. You see a lot of these games are definitely like going more indoors or like in kind of closed environments like you're talking about. This one definitely has the more, they got the parkour elements. You've got the, uh, the, the big buildings, you can jump from building to building, you got the big open fields for the robots to fight in. And that's the other thing too, is cool, the, 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 uh, the inclusion of the Titans, the large mech suits we've been seeing, uh, are really sweet. You have this element of like, okay, I'm a guy versus the big robot, and there's a dynamic there, there's a meta, the, uh, the Titan versus Titan element, then uh, it, it's a guy versus guy element. So you have to kind of like be playing differently depending on how your opponents are set up and how uh, who has a Titan at what time, uh, how you use the Titan while you have it so you don't squander that opportunity. Uh, it definitely seems like for someone who wants a little bit more strategy out of a shooter, this one definitely has a lot of uh, elements going on that you're going to have to factor into your planning and how you go at it. It's not just going to be the same game every time you play it. Absolutely. Everything's uh, different enough. And uh, oh, I was waiting for the other thing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, all right. We're going to hang on a second. It's very loud. Sorry about that. We're going to go to the right now. Everybody's got a chance to win if you get a raffle ticket. I'm going to give it over to Meg. Uh, I'm going to give it over to Meg. Bear with us. We're clipping yeah, while... Uh, well, the raffle happens. By the way, absolutely support their Extra Life uh, charity. They're great guys. Oh. You can still talk to Sagan Americans if you're Yes, we are. This is Pop Dog Futon, so you can see that. Okay, I'm just wondering. It seems like it's live still, it's just we keep getting ads on. Yeah! Just what? Oh, okay. No worries. He walks away. He walks away, he doesn't want it. You're the best! He walked away, he didn't want it. Oh, that's good. Please put it back in. Uh, once again, guys, uh, just letting you know that. Oh, and there is some music again. Okay, let's get people to pop out. I'm going to be playing. Awesome. Um, so yeah, we're uh, back. Yeah, once again, guys, sorry about the loud noise in here. Uh, we are live from the Microsoft Store, and they got music going here. They're making announcements every so often, so we're going to do our best to be heard over that. But, uh, that sounds like that. Yeah, no, it sounds pretty good. Okay, I've been told by uh, uh, Chief Technician uh, uh, Evan Starkman that, uh, that it sounds pretty good. So uh, I'm glad you guys can hear us then. I'm definitely worried about that. So uh, as soon troops stop down from the sky there, he's going to take the traditional corridor shooting uh, route going through the buildings. I prefer to jump around the rooftops like a crazy person, but that's just me. It's, it's nice to kind of jump up the side of the buildings too, do a little parkour and jump back around. Yeah. Now you see everybody kind of uh, usually goes to the same place at the beginning, which could be a good thing or a bad thing. You need extra support. But uh, oh, here come the enemies, okay, and uh, the grunts are just getting oh, wow. mowed down. Oh, except for that guy. He knew what he was doing. So he closed, hit behind the grunts. That was the thing I've heard about this game. Is, uh, there, there are like AI characters who are yes. like, on the teams, right? Yeah. Yeah, the, uh, there are a handful of butts in every match, and you can definitely tell the difference, but uh, it's, it's kind of fun to have fodder to plow through while you're looking for strong opponents. So you can always get your kills, you can always keep the game uh, going. You're not just spawning and getting killed constantly. That's a really awesome mechanic. I, I haven't heard of any others, at least not the one I know of, doing that kind of thing. I think that, once again, this is a game where they brought a whole lot of diverse elements into it that are going to make every time you play this game really different. So I, I think it's going to be what I thought. 
Yes, in general, is you have this kind of thing where you play for a few months and you get bored because it's kind of rehashing the same game over and over again. And this one seems like a game where you're going to have a very different experience every time you play. Well, I'll tell you, I was really skeptical when I heard about the idea of putting the grunts in and only having 6v6. I thought there wouldn't be enough people. I thought it would be really boring. But when you play it, you can definitely see the difference. But the key difference is that people usually get the Titans. The grunts run around, the grunts are fodder, the grunts will help. But you worry about the people who are going to kill you and the Titans, and uh, it really uh, keeps you on your toes. Because you you uh, put your guard down when you're fighting the grunts, somebody comes around the corner blows you away. Yeah, and you know, I think that just from a perspective of someone who uh, doesn't necessarily play FPS, but coming from somewhere where I like kaiju, I like giant robots uh -huh, yeah. and stuff, I love that there are going to be a lot of fun little meat bags running around on the ground with my big robot just is massive. Oh yeah, I I'll tell you, when you're a Titan, Using any of the weapons to just blow away the grunts is incredibly satisfying. I mean, let's, let's face it, if you're like a giant, like, seven robot, do you want to smash, like, just one guy, or do you want to smash, like, seven guys at once with, like, a mission cannon or something? Like, that's exactly, and I mean, you can step on the guys, you can shoot them with your weapons, you can do all manner of crazy things, and, uh, it's really a good time. You know, I've, uh, I've always secretly felt that I am a giant robot in a man's body, and I think that this game's going to be a really good experience for me to kind of live my life the way that I really want to live. So that's awesome. Uh, Thank you. Keep up the good work. Uh, oh, I'm a flamethrower then. I can tell you, I have a giant robot, I would have a flamethrower hooked up. I don't even care. Oh, uh, missiles are out. There oh, they go. Oh, missiles too, though. I love the spiral. Oh, secret missiles. That was sick. That reminded me of both Battle Tanks games. Ah, that was a great game. Oh, 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 absolutely. Yeah, no, that was one of my favorite games, though. You gotta pay attention. You gotta take it. You gotta drag it. Oh, grab the pilot. Oh, robot punch. Robot punch. Robot punch. Oh, and he ejected. He ejected. He's gonna try to rodeo on the back there. Oh, he missed it. That's okay. That was a good effort. I and, definitely uh, know, man. Now he's, he's either glitching or hanging out or something. Oh, that doesn't, yeah, that's something awesome. right. Or maybe, is the round over? No, I think the round's the, over. The, little, the robot dog in the corner is talking to him. I don't know if uh -oh. he's clearing things up for us. Wow. Maybe he fell asleep. All right, he's awake. Oh, he's, all, he's all good. He's awake. It's all good. He was just, uh, he was playing possum, probably. We have a narcoleptic player here. That's okay. Yeah, that's all right. And look, here are all the grunts. So you can't shoot them with the, uh, with the, wow, see, they're just waiting for the to down. Yeah, that's, that's the difference between the grunts and the people, I'll tell you. He was standing there with a pilot lock, uh, a weapon that can only lock onto the Titans. Didn't know how to switch out. It's actually X. I didn't know the first time either. And he just stood there, and the grunts didn't take him up for a long time. And this is a game where we were saying before, like, a lot of people, it's their first time playing it. They're coming out here to play it on launch night, so, uh, and this is not going to be exactly like an MLG level uh, Titanfall action, but it is going to be a lot of people having fun. And uh, by the way, uh, I don't know if you can still get in, but I believe you can. If you come down to the Natick Mall tonight, to the Microsoft Store, I believe you can still get in. You can definitely play with us. You may even end up on stream like these guys. So if you're in the area, definitely come and uh, hang out with us. Absolutely. We're going to be going on until midnight, the midnight launch of the game. I don't think everybody will go home and continue to play it. All the units must attack six. We are crushing the inferno. The battle's almost over. Oh god damn it, no. Five in the world. Titans as old as time. Strong to say the least. Beauty and the Titan is not why we're here. We are here for Beauty and the Titan. Once oh, we're, we're getting there. So Wait, there's three ways to go. Victory! You want some Kimura? Oh, you're under our control. Well done. Oh, no. Although, yet, everything is hard to do. All right. Is it castle-like? Spoiled. Selfish. Xbox One. So now you see the epilogue of the game. We have to eliminate all the enemy pilots and sometimes some of the beasts. I've heard about this. this is kind of they played it. It's basically like a killing it. spree. Yeah. It's going to be very fun. And you might see the dropship element come in. Thank you, Maddie. That was beautiful. That's good stuff. Wow. That was unexpected. Yeah, so this is eliminate all the enemies and uh, don't let them get to the dropship. Don't let them uh, lick their wounds and, and leave. Oh, yo, look at that water. That's beautiful. That's nice water. That's like Mario Bros. That was awesome. You can tell the kind of games I play the work with computers. So most of the people who are here are here because they either wanted to play or pre-order Titanfall. Yep. I actually pre-ordered Dark Souls 2. Yeah. I'm probably the only person here for that. But... Uh, no, actually, I, I am here as well. Oh, excellent. Yeah. Good, good. Great mods. Yep. Yeah, I am excited for that. I'm getting the uh, collector's edition because I want to get the little statuette and the uh, beautiful map that comes with that game. Oh, and here we have a rodeo. Oh he's, uh, he's on the back of the Titan. He's going to try to take the pilot out, do as much damage, and it's over. Oh, man. It's over. It's over. Oh, you kids God. remember Homestar Runner? No, oh, you're probably no. too young. Oh, no, people here aren't under the age of 40. They don't know about Homestar Runner. <laughs> uh, I was told that the person who's up next to play on the stream here it was just announced that if Dan and I want to play Jermaine, he gets added to Okay, now I'm ordering. Okay, I, no one on stream's gonna care about this, but it was just announced that if Daniel Bryan defeats Triple H at WrestleMania, he's gonna be added to the world title match as the main event of that show. So oh. I just went from not spending 40 bucks to spending 40 bucks on WrestleMania this year. <laughs> so that's fantastic. 
Well, that's good news for uh, WrestleMania. I, I'm like, excited for this game, for people to kind of get a feel for this game, so uh, later tonight I can do some pretty hype commentaries. People are murdering each other at Coach Jim Ross mode on this thing. But, uh, yeah, no, uh, what I was going to say was um, I've been told that uh, our uh, resident uh, PC gamer at our store, uh, Sean, a.k.a. Uh, Canty Games, or Canty, AKA be Little Wolverine. Exactly. It's going to be uh, next on stream, so he told me that. Uh, oh, good. This should be him playing, I believe. I don't know if it's from his perspective, but he will be in this game. I Sean think is uh, definitely a competitor in these types of games. I've played against him in a number of things. He usually destroys me. It's I'd true. expect he's, nothing he's, less today, but this is probably his first or second time playing this game. He's very good. Uh, okay, we're going to be uh, restarting the stream real quick. We're having connection issues, but we'll be right back with you. Never mind. Oh, no, never mind. Never mind. That was a quick restart, folks. We're, we're already back. We're good. We're back. See how quick that was? It was you like ripping off a band aid. It was easy. Microsoft store, uh... I like the Microsoft Store uh, icon there, the, the Cheeseburger Man. Yeah, Love you, Cheeseburger Man. There's nothing more American than cheeseburgers and Xbox, I'll tell you what. That's true. I would feel a surge of uh, patriotism right now if it weren't for the fact that I was Canadian. You said patriotism in September. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> On a completely unrelated topic while we're sitting here, have you played the South Park RPG Strick of Truth? I have not because I'm a terrible uh, person. So I'll, I'll tell you. I played through it, I beat it, it's a nice 10 hour game, um, a lot of people are going to be turned off by that, I think it's a great lane, it's definitely a different RPG experience, it plays a lot like uh, Super Mario RPG, like a semi-traditional, oh, wow, okay, you sold a copy right there to me, yeah, well it's like a traditional <laughs> JRPG, but you can uh, you jump in and you, you have to actively be a part of combat, you have to press buttons at certain oh, times, like Super Star Saga, okay. yes exactly, cool. Superstar Saga is another good, uh, a good uh, idea, and uh, the humor is top notch, it's a very funny game, yeah, I, 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 th I think for every person who gets turned off by that South Park kind of humor, you're gonna get like two or three people who are actually really interested. Like, if you buy a South Park game, you know what you're getting into. So, I, I don't think that's a huge concern for them. Really. And even if you've only watched a couple seasons, it's definitely a love letter to South Park from South Park. There's so many in jokes, all the junk items you pick up, all things from the show. You collect all the Chin Pokemon as collectibles. I, I got the Wild Wacky Action Bike in Alabama, man. It's a good game. All right, I'm gonna let Jamie back in because he's the main man. Uh, are you sure? Yes, I'm, oh, I'm sure? swapping out for Jamie. Oh, okay. Jamie, Thanks enjoy. for joining us. That was Retro Joe. Plug your YouTube channel real quick. We need to be back. All right, y'all plug it. Okay. We need to talk out here for a minute. Yep. Uh, it's Jamie, the owner of Game Underground, back over here. Welcome back, Jamie. Um, okay, so Sean's about to play on stream. Yeah, that's what we were just saying. Yeah, I, I don't mean to interrupt the show. I, I don't know. I, I feel uh, bad, but. Yeah, uh, uh, can't you? Can't you, Angel? Yeah. Yeah. All backseat commentary. So, okay, here's the thing with Canty the Angel. Yep. You can say what you want about Canty the Angel. Yeah. He's effective in there. That's what he does. I expect no less. Then first place finish, what do you think? Uh, yeah, I, I've heard that he has his eyes on the prize as far as he, he wants to win this whole thing. He said that multiple times throughout the week. Uh, in backstage interviews, he was very optimistic about his chances. I heard um, him being like, yeah, I might come. Yeah, I heard that too. <laughs> <laughs> I, the, the, attitude but he's here tonight. the attitude that I think was put forth was, yeah, maybe I'll show up and if I do, I'll beat everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Which, right. if, if you know Candy or Sean, is definitely... We're, we're underway here. Okay. We actually have water for you, man. Uh, it kind of looks like he knows what he's doing already. He does. Uh, he's had some experience in this game, hasn't he? Did he play the beta? I'm not sure. Right now. He plays the pod, though. But, uh... Yeah, so this will be the match. Maybe you'll get to see some more kind of... Uh, someone who's played in FPS before knows what's up. Uh, maybe experiment. If he hasn't played, he might be experimenting with controls right now. It looks like he's figuring out his plugin configuration or whatever. But, uh, it would be fun if he gets owned, we can just talk about it. Oh, forever. no, no, we're going to talk so much about it. Get us going right here. Yeah, I haven't seen any Chinese fall yet. Uh, we're not really. Oh, yeah, there he goes. Yeah. Yeah. Well. So, as you can see, that guy shot him from the roof or across the thing. So. Yep. Alright, so we got some Titans coming in here now. Yeah, so now the robots are coming down. They're going to lay waste to the battlefield. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, man. It's a terrible idea. I don't have a rocket launcher with a pilot bomb. I'm supposed to get into that class. Find out the hard way a couple times. Oh, yeah, candy, candy might be finding out that right as we speak right now. Like he was saying, there's a, um, you know, Titan, uh, what do you call them? Titan special class weapons. Right. That are uh, better to fight the Titans with. That's why they're called that. Oh, I got it. Yeah, yeah. There you go. <laughs> that is the. Oh, he's riding on the other guy! Riding on robots! That's what I'm talking about! See that? Oh, God. Now he just stand there and let his friend die. That's what he did. No, he was killed. Oh, he, got shot. he got killed. That was insane. That was cool. some Yoshi it, Mario. Yeah, that was Yomi to get me on it. Ahead of your opponents. Oh my god. Well, that was a cool, if not effective, uh, tactic right there. 
No, I'm I think sorry, if, you're, if you're working together with a teammate doing that, that can really uh, do some good stuff. I mean, everything is awesome. Right, so he's got the rocket launcher here. He's, he's ready for Titanfall. Titanfall. So, I oh, wonder if he's going to aim the Titan to drop it off. Oh, oh, he's 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 right right so oh, now he he's started in the Titan. That's pretty he's great. got the flames going. Oh, no, that's fine. That's a grenade launcher, maybe? Yo, he's got psychic powers! Uh, I'm hearing people already calling that the Roman Reigns weapon. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> you should have a steer gun too, just make uh, uh, that. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah, 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 Oh, yeah. Yo, he's out of there! He's out of there! Oh, man. What's he gonna do? Yo! He's riding on him! He's on opening this thing! Oh, man! He's shoot the motor! He's unloading into the motor! This is attack on Titan! Yo! He just shoot his brain out of the Titan there. Jamie, that was an attack on Titan if ever I saw one. That was incredible. Wow. That is the type. That's the type of thing I expect from Candy and the Angel tonight. Absolutely. That's how you do it. No more scrubbing it up. It's time that's to play Big Boy Ball. Titan slang right there. Wow. That was incredible. So, Joe, when that's yes, happening to you, uh, what are your defenses if you're the Titan? If you're the Titan, you can hope somebody shoots you up, or I think there's a, a, a button to try to reach back and grab them. Can you shake them and things like that? Or you can't uh, shake them, I think you can try to reach back and grab them and pop them off. Oh, there's, a, awesome. there's a cold guy, guy over there. He didn't see that, but that's a cold guy. We're making his run. Hopefully he doesn't shoot him in the back. What was that? Oh, he's trying to... Oh, there he is. Oh. Oh. There was a cold guy running around next to him. Yeah, yeah okay. Yeah, he's trying to face him. He has a camo a la Metal Gear Solid 4. And oh, wow, that's amazing. <laughs> Some laughing octopus action here in the state fall. <laughs> yeah, see, I love the mobility you get from doing the other part. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's usually a direct death right there. Yep. I, I predict very high. I see Sean will drop the Titan on somebody. No, he's just gonna call it the same here. You see, here comes the Titan fall. Oh, the Titan fall. Make the same way, make the same way. No, this one looks like I'm gonna lose it. AI offline. Pilot mode engaged. It's a Strider. Uh, it's a Strider Garu. Oh, it's an ogre! This is the only, uh... There, there's people the yelling only, different types of yeah, If it is an ogre, this is the only type in the game that has layers. So, we just have to have to have to have to We got an ogre yeah. now. This, uh, this type was once a result against people's last boss. Another Titan is attacking you. Yo, we got an achievement. What did he just do there? This game is absolutely. Here's all. Here's the epilogue where you go and order all the enemy pilots. Some salty player is leaving the Titanfall arena right now. So uh, the idea here is you have to kill them before they get away. Right. If you do, you get extra XP, I believe. I'll say yeah, that's pretty sweet. Uh, but if they get away, they get extra XP. I like any uh, giant robot or giant monster game where I'm allowed to step on the thing and it's going to flicker my hair. So I'm, uh, I'm definitely a fan of this mode. Oh, it's just awesome. That's really cool. This is like Rampage uh, World Tour for the uh, first person. Oh, oh yeah, so there it is. Alpha Strike and unload everything in his arsenal. I think that all is oh, oh, there it is! Oh, no. oh, goodbye, drop ship. And someone's family is going to be missing somewhere. Oh, no. Addict, oh, the the knocking out the drop ship. Yeah, there it is. Yo, Evan, Complete what's carnage. that? Blasting them with a uh, salt, uh, salt missile. Uh, oh, you got the webcam all good to go? And I am checking I my street passes. That's a good decision. Yo, it's Burger Man! Yeah, he's Burger Man over here. I love Burger Man. Got a ton that of was Chivos. great, man. Wow, look at all the XP you got for that. That was pretty sweet. I, I like seeing that uh, brain surgery. I, I think Sean yeah. is showing off his achievements here. Yep. Let's like, see my achievements I've unlocked. I thought we were maybe going to watch the Dragon Ball Z there. Uh, we're doing a quick little uh, technical... Uh, oh, hey. No, 
now you can see us. You see my awful hair. Fantastic. Go check it out. This is my gorgeous. No, it, look how messy that is. There you go. It's gone. It's red. It can do whatever it's it wants. You know, people, the first thing they'll notice better than it's red. It's fine. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not checking my speed passes. Don't worry about me. He's fine. He's not doing it. Look at him playing Nintendo that's, that's stuff. That's a Microsoft tablet. That's not anything else. Oh. I love the Microsoft 3DS. It's a micro. It's pretty good. It's a Microsoft 3DS. There you go. Yeah. I'm, I'm camouflaging it good. All right. Uh, is he gonna be? Is he, is he still on there? Or is he gonna be replaced by someone else now? I think he's still on there, right? Can't do his loadout. Can you see his stun still up? Yeah, it's still Canty on there. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, he's changing his loadout around. He's trying to figure he's out how he's going to play. He's not sponsored. I'm not sponsoring him. He is not sponsored oh, by no. DMV. DMV will not sponsor Canty the Angel. Uh, oh, if you are tuning in to CGCW, yep. <laughs> uh, we will be some returning. bad news for you. <laughs> Uh, our WWE League will be returning every Monday night. Uh, and starting next week. Yeah, we're aiming for 9. Are we going to get consistent with 9 o'clock starts or 10 o'clock? We're aiming for 9 o'clock for PCW. We'll have another meeting about it. We're going to we'll have, have more meeting. meetings. Uh, meetings are backstage. Oh, I knew it was only Matt time before I saw a kill. Also, if, you, uh, if you're checking this Titanfall stuff out, uh, we will be having Titanfall events at Game Underground. Yeah. Uh, we're really excited. Uh, we have a little bit more to do, but oh, part of being here at the Microsoft store, they're going to be doing stuff, teaming up with us on our Oh, here comes the drop! Watch this! We don't need to land! And Get the hell out of our airplane! Oh, Do those boxes just fall out of the sky? Uh, uh, yeah. It's notorious for uh, killing uh, Tori Wilson in uh, uh, WWE Raw on the Xbox. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I love that. Challenge is good. I think I just won. Yep, that's it. Good game. Ted, can we uh, can we get yeah. Joe in on the mic? Thank you. Thanks, man. Thanks, you can just uh, share it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Sorry to take your seat. Uh, and I'm back. Cool. So we're, we're now up. And Ted moved, and we lost five viewers. So. <laughs> oh, well, the people come. They're tuning in. You're more than welcome to talk too. I, I, uh, yeah, I, was, I got busy with, uh, with the girlfriend. Yeah. Uh, Beyonce. Yeah. I, I didn't hear a word uh, of that. So okay. guys. All right, so. This is an interesting map. A lot of corridors, a lot of tight spaces, and a lot of open area. Yeah, absolutely. So there's a lot of, you can kind of see in the map, there's like a set area for the Titan to walk around, and there's a lot of small corridors for people to really jump in and out of and, uh, and crawl behind. As you see, this is more traditional shooting mechanics. You got some more Call of Duty style stuff in the corridors. You run out into the open, you got the Titan, you got people on the rooftop, you got people on the, uh, the rafters and whatnot. So there's a good mix going on here. And of course, you can see the grunts are getting mowed down left and right. So it's one battle to come to them, uh, but that was a real play. You see, that's what usually happens. Take a couple runs down, a real player comes along and smokes you. Uh, the drop ship dropping on more people in the spray. The forklift there showing. Uh, the high behind that forklift makes a good cover. I'm interested in seeing if uh, Candy does better in this one because now he's been able to uh, fiddle his loadout. He's had, a time, he's had time to like play around and figure out all the uh, mechanics and whatnot. Um, and he got a challenge a minute ago. Yep. It was uh, called dodgeball, I believe. It was, it was throw a grenade and, uh, uh, yeah, and hit the guy with it. Yeah, yeah that was pretty cool. Uh, if there's one thing I know from watching uh, Sean play FPS games, it's that he loves those other things. Yeah. Well, you know what? If they're in your hand, they're they're not killing anyone. I mean, that's absolutely. Yeah, he has that uh, that long range plan. Look at this. Oh yeah. my god! Oh my god! Oh, hit yeah. that guy! Melee kill. Yeah, welcome to Crunch. Go. 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 I think it's safe to say that Kenny's definitely found his element now. Uh, and so now he, he loaded in himself. on the Titanfall this time. Uh, I mean the Titan. The, uh, yeah, the, the Titan. He's got teammates over there. It's weird. I have a style of gameplay where I try to uh, do things as flashy as possible, maybe right. not as effective. Like piling tables like seven feet tall and throwing people through. Right, in the WWE game, I don't really care if I win the match. I care about if I put on a go. This will be a great game for you because I, I can tell you, even when you're getting killed and you're getting destroyed, this game is still really fun. It's really fun. It's a three on one fight the gangbang right here. Holy oh, look at that. Wow. He's looking out with his gun. That was impressive. Yeah, the Titans are powerful.
cool, but if you get two against one, you're not going to survive very long. You need to get some really good skills going on. Let's really know how to how to use your attacks and your defenses and cycle them well because their cooldown time is very, very high. So, so Joe, when it comes to like a, uh, a pilot taking on a fight, like the guy that maybe has a lot of running around, it's not fun. Is it more like a death attack? Let's see whether everyone's got some up on them or is it like one guy's too good? You can definitely do it if the Titan's distracted and doesn't notice what you're doing. Right. The rodeo works a lot because the pilots too close to what they're shooting and they don't see the guy in their back. You can have, have absolutely at least participate in the game. You just have to have one man to take down a Titan. Especially if the Titan doesn't know or isn't paying attention. Because the Titan's gonna fight on the Titan. That's what you're supposed to do. Is the Titan alerted if they're on you? Yes, but it's at the top of the screen and usually it's out of the way of your crosshairs, so you don't notice immediately unless you're looking for it. Uh, but you will start blinking, you will see the bar at the top, you will see the damage you're taking. And a lot of people are ignoring it right now, and uh, when the game is, is out for a little bit longer, you're going to find that's not going to be the case. I, I would assume that if you're in a situation where there's not a gigantic DJ sound, uh, you can be calling your friends over, being like, yo, he's on me, shoot him off, shoot him off, type of thing. Absolutely. You get that teamwork going on. Stands for reason. Whoop. Yeah, I'm really liking oh, this game. Oh, no, he just got killed by the uh, clue from Tron right there. Oh, jeez. That's unfortunate. When that happens. That could definitely throw him better. But I could use some grenades there. Grenades not too useful against the Titans, but uh, yeah, I, I, I gotta damage. say, uh, credit for uh, balls and not brains here with hands. Going after these uh, Titans one on one as a dude. Uh, the dude bro is definitely not doing so great against the giant robots one on one, though. Is that? Oh, hey, uh, Chris, uh, welcome to Chris Angel the chat. Uh, we just heard your talk there in there. Unfortunately, we can't see what you're saying, but I've uh, just been alerted by someone using a different device that, or, uh, that you're in there and talking, so we appreciate you tuning in to watch. Uh, along with everyone else who's watching right now, or if you're watching as a VOD somewhere else, oh, is, is it showing up just on Twitch or is it going on YouTube as well? Yeah, uh, this will be on YouTube. Okay, so also, if uh, if you want to check any part of this out later, if you missed part of it or you have to go to bed early, you're not going to see the end and you want to see more, uh, youtube.com slash Game Underground. Uh, Game Underground Store, yeah. Game Underground Store on YouTube. Uh, and of course on this Twitch channel, it'll be archived at some point as well. Uh, and maybe other places as well, but that's all we know right now. And if you're watching this on YouTube or on Twitch VOD, thank you for tuning in. This is awesome. This was recorded live in the Microsoft Store in the Natick Mall. Uh, we are here for the launch of Titanfall. We're from Game Underground. As well as we're going to the road in Framingham, uh, Massachusetts, and Iowa, and Framingham. And uh, we're excited to stream stuff every Monday night and on a whole bunch of other nights as well. Uh, but tonight we're far from home. We are doing a road show here at the Microsoft Store. And uh, it's going to be pretty cool. Uh, we're having a lot of fun so far. Uh, our resident uh, FPS guy, uh, the more of these gamer guys, uh, uh, a.k.a. Sean, is uh, showing us how it's done here on Titanfall. As well as competing for an Xbox One, I believe. That's right. Uh, I believe it's part of the, uh, the playing today. And one of the prizes is going to be an Xbox One, which is going to be very interesting. Uh, I already have won some Xbox One, but Xbox One is running, so I'm going right, to go home with a big old prize. Dying like a man, uh, going back into the fray. But uh, I don't believe you can shoot, or if you can, you're not going to do very much damage. So uh, it kind of adds insult to injury when you lose, but it still gives you something to do. It doesn't immediately right. end the match, and it's a nice little change that I haven't seen in the game before. There might have been something like that in maybe uh, one of the Battlefield or Battlefront games, but I don't believe so. Yeah, it, it's really, I kind of like, as much as I was rooting for Sean, I'm kind of happy that his team lost the turn, because now we've got to see back-to-back uh, -back 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 mode where you're the robot, you're the winners, going after the guys escaping, and now we're also going to see it from the, uh, the fleeing uh, team's perspective. And uh, this looks pretty cool, this is kind of like almost a stealth mission now, you know, as he's trying to evade. Oh, he's doing great, so I guess he does have some offense to get those. Yeah, so I guess he can still do that, so he's basically trying to stay alive while he's got, uh, he's got nine seconds to get that drop ship. Uh, Which is probably not going to happen. I think he's going to make it. Way out. Oh. There it is. Oh, oh, is. oh no. Three, two, one, and he is dead. And yep. that's that. That's unfortunate. Another yeah. good game, another fallen type. Uh, so I believe we'll go to a third round now because Mr. Wet 3, yeah? Uh, I believe so. Yeah, so uh, we'll obviously one more game with Candy here right now before they start kicking people off. Oh, actually, no, no, never mind. No, he's actually off now. No, yeah, I was listening to it. Oh, yeah, yeah. That, do you want to get on commentary real quick? You want to say anything? Okay. He doesn't want to say anything, but yeah. I don't uh, want to talk to you. We have seven viewers talking about Triple H. We have seven viewers talking about Triple H. Wow. <laughs> Wait, what's up there? Oh, you can see the chat? Oh, sure. we can see the chat uh, on the big uh -oh. screen here in the store. <laughs> Yo, massive spoilers on our screen. Yo, I hope you guys are going to record Raw on the DVR because you're going to be disappointed. <laughs> 
Is Jill. it Chris Angel? Yes. Sean. It's Kirsten. It's Chris. <laughs> Sorry, Chris. I'm afraid I got some bad news. I'm afraid I got some bad news. This is a subpoena. Yo, that 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 Titan Fall selfie. Oh, hey, how's it going? Uh, the case for this? <laughs> I am terrible. I don't know how to switch my camera. Oh, don't worry about it. I'm terrible at actually uh, taking post pictures, so I'm just gonna pretend I don't see the camera there and see what happens. I'm in the way of everything. All right, that's okay. So we're in between matches here, so we're just milling around right now, uh, I'm gonna take yucking it up, as they say. Now, Ryan, you should definitely see if you can get a space in there and play some Titanfall eventually. Oh, I'm definitely going to try. My plan right now is, uh, much like in Titanfall, I'm going to try to win the War of Attrition. Uh -huh. I want to uh, wait until people kind of like die off, and then I'm going to go in for the kill uh, when there's like three or four people playing to help me that's going to be game. Uh, nothing big yet. They gave away two Xbox Gold memberships, but none of the big, all the big stuff's still here. Still uh, you should talk you to a Microsoft it. Store guy. Don't you have these? This is your ticket, then let's call Oh, yeah. yeah. Here we go. Yeah. 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 No worries. Hold on my head. Okay. No worries. Uh, so we've got, uh, yo, he's, uh, they're picking a Titan now. Uh, we, this is something, we don't know who this is playing right now, it's just a random now, but uh, hopefully we'll see some pretty sick Titanfall action. Uh, oh, somebody asked a question about Stick of Truth, I couldn't see it because I can't see the screen. Oh man. How come we can't see the, uh, the screen? Uh, there's a, a problem on our end with not seeing, you mean chat right there? Yeah. Yeah, we can't see chat right now, this is an issue on our end, but uh, chat is working elsewhere, it's just okay. our local system that's not picking it up for whatever reason. Oh, gotcha. But uh, uh, if we want to see chat, we can kind of eyeball it from a distance away. Uh, I see, oh, Canty's in the stream now. So the, uh, if you want to talk to the guy who's just playing, you can chat with him right now on stream. I'm the one who said the music here blows. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we can see. They know who you are too. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not going to be able to hear out the right side of my ear tomorrow. Yeah, there are some fat beats in this store right now. If you can hear them over the... fat or uh, just the other kind of fat? Uh, I would say the P-H-A-T kind. Oh, okay. That's better. Makes me want to go and buy some food in here. I can't believe the stream is still talking about wrestling. This is not wrestling time. This is this is Titanfall time. We're here in Smuggler's Cove. Everyone's Cold, really mad about wrestling. Fun, I guess. The people are furious about wrestling. There might be a riot. They're really mad. They're taking over this stream. Wait, what's going down? There, a fedora riot might happen. It's pretty crazy. Apparently, I see one that says Ryan's the cool guy behind the counter, and he's single. What's that? If you know what else is single, this man right here is going in for the Titans. All right, so running around the ground, going behind corners, and uh, looks like he's going to go right into the fray here. I'm Ryan. He sees a uh, front there, and nope. uh, oh, he's not taking out. That's all good. okay. Now, if you haven't played it yet, which a lot of you probably up? haven't, the shotgun in this game is immensely satisfying. It has a good kick to it, it has a very strong noise. Oh, yeah, that's it does right. a lot of damage. Uh, hey. That's what he's doing right now, as you can see. I just got a shout out on stream. Too bad Almost I can't any of those here. grunts and any of the regular guys. It's very powerful. If you line it up right, it's a really good we weapon. Uh, the carbine lets you do a little bit more. All right, I want to give a shout out to Canty for being a massive troll. Yeah, we got some trolling going on in the chat right now. We got some grapple going, and uh, he's going to try to take out that guy behind him, and he does it. And uh, you can tell the difference between the grunts, they have grunt what, right now? the other people are called community, they ah. have names. So he got yeah, one guy, then a grunt, and uh, he's going after another. And the, uh, the shotgun, of course, does not have the range of some of the other weapons, yeah, weapons like the carbine, but a lot more power than the weight they get in the first. I didn't bring my fedora tonight. Let's see if he here. Is he going to switch to his, uh, his rocket? I believe he is. Let's see. Uh, no, no, he's not a He's mowing down these grunts, and uh, even has time to reload before finishing off the last one. That is, uh, the, the grunts are not a threat. Not at all. But they're a good distraction. And uh, geez, between a Titan and a hard place, he calls another Titan. It looks like he's in. He's going to try to take out this one here. He's running away. doesn't even see him. So, uh, looks like he's a good chance. Away with the sidewinders. And uh, he is. Looks like he's going down. He's on fire for good. It's a uh, two on one, and uh, that's the end of the game. So now he's getting hit from behind, but let's turn around and see what's happening. Uh, is that someone on his back? Oh, that's another Titan. Same oh, that's another Titan. Okay, cool. Yep. So, uh, three on one here. He's not having a chance. He's going down. There's some more people in the play. I think there's another Titan. Oh, there's a rodeo. He's on the back. Looks like he's on the back, burning up. All right, no more of that. So, uh, the Titan, you, without the mobility of some of the other classes, you really have to motor to see where you're needed. Sometimes you'll find random people running around. You can take them down pretty easily. Yeah. But, uh, if you really yeah, want to make a robot throw some dudes around. Oh yeah, we well, see, he's, he can one-shot these little grunts here if he can hit them. Uh, so the Titans against the, yeah, the guys, there's really no so, contest. Uh, if this scale is to be believed, the bull's probably about the size of a torso, so... Oh yeah, but the problem is that the pain is really high to the uh, little uh, 
Look to try and use the Titans to go to certain areas, so bring up the shield against the Titan there. Drop on one more, the guy's missing one to the right, he's taking my ice and the punch. The gun, and uh, he's trying to use the shield, he is punching back and forth, they're both uh, going down to more health. Oh, oh, yo, oh, robot's like, oh, he's doing his arms up! Oh, oh my god, god that robot's got a family! No more of him. Did he just beat no that robot him. with its own arms? He just arms. beat that robot to death with its own arms! Oh god, the robo-humanity! And now he's hanging out on the beach, just going for a nice little dip, trying to get back to the fray. If you get too far away from the rest of the fight as a Titan, you could be uh, really putting your team at a disadvantage. So, oh, the pilot locks. Somebody's shooting a missile at him from, uh, from a rocket launcher. Living. And uh, he's trying to seize him, he's going to try to take him out, but... Uh, you know, those guys can get to the small little holes and corridors the Titan can't go, so if you're on your own, it can be very, uh, very trying. And uh, he's looking, looking for a little bit of something to shoot here. Looks like everyone else is on the other side of the map, so he's trying to make his way back. I uh, see the other Titan come down, he's trying to get back to where his allies are. And uh, we do see some explosions. Uh, oh, there's another Titan. He's going to be over there. We've got a taskbar on our way right now, I think. And another power block is definitely getting uh, some rocket thrown at him, but uh, wasn't able to connect off. Oh, Fire at the Titan's sidewalk is going off. It's in the blinding uh, light reference of the, the Taioken Fist of the Sun from Dragon Ball Z, if anybody gets that reference. And uh, following some grunts around the corridor, see if he can take any out. Nope, hiding in the back. And uh, he's, oh, he's oh, getting hit with the unit. rocket. So the there's a guy right there who's probably going to try to rodeo him because he didn't even try to hit him. He, uh, he ran right past him. Oh, right. oh, 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 there it is. There it is. Oh, Someone's on his back, back right now. I don't know if he's noticed, but he's got a dude trying to rip the out right now. Oh, no, he did notice. He's out of there. Well, he had noticed because he's told him to eject. Oh, okay, cool. So now he's out. And he's trying to desperately find that one. It looks like he's already gone. Uh, did he steal his Titan? I think he might have. Yeah, I was, I was gonna say, can you actually like no, steal no, the, the Titan's guy's on, back there? Uh, the Titan's on auto right now. Oh, okay. So he told it to run around until he follow him. Can someone do a rodeo oh, action? Can they potentially get into the Titan's yeah, yeah, yeah. uh, I Honestly, I think you can, but I don't know. I haven't been able to do anything myself. Oh, yeah. oh, awesome! We now have chat capabilities. So oh, there we go. If, you are, if you're deciding to talk on screen, we can now actually see what you're saying. <laughs> Now, I've seen a lot of people got take advantage of the uh, auto titan routine, letting it run around behind them because it draws all the fire. You can take the people out one by one. And you know, it's a good strategy this time. The titans attract a lot of attention. Up going to the rodeo. Going to the rodeo, taking it up. No, he's gone. He, uh, he went out as the titan blew up. So, and that climactic, but he was doing his part. Oh man. So we got some of that, uh, uh, look, oh my god, I forgot the word, parkour, thank you. It is Action. now a little past uh -huh. 11 o'clock, we are right a mere 55 minutes away from Titan Touchdown here in the United States of America in Dating Mall at the Microsoft Store for the Titan Mall launch yep. party. Now uh, we're running out with a shotgun back in the free of the straight. Yeah, we are from uh, Game Underground at 1251 Wilson Road in uh, Brittany, Mexico, Central so Time West, and uh, we're going to be uh, doing here for the next uh, hour and a half or so, I think, for uh, the time. Uh, we'll be here as long before the people are um, uh, we'll, This is my first version game, Joe's played a little bit of it, so uh, a little bit. Like a little bit. I'm really want to talk about it. It does have more knowledge than I do, but I'm definitely uh, seeing this with broken eyes right now. It's pretty sweet. As the resident pseudo expert who's played a couple matches, I will uh, pretend I know everything about it. And uh, so you see, I mean, that, that's how everyone on the internet is anyway, so that's about as effective. If you were to ask anyone their opinion of war, it would be as valid as what Joe's talking about. Now, see, that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you get stepped on by a Titan. Oh, uh, when you go up to it with your uh, generic machine gun cannon thing, you're not going to go very far. I mean, I, yeah. You usually want to switch to your missile and get behind something to cover, see if you can take it out. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but it does damage. And as Absolutely. you see, now he's in a Titan mowing, mowing down other players on the grunts, one shotting him with the carbine with that uh, the cannon, there goes another one, and there he's dead. Oh my god. It does not good. take much, and that's why you really want to focus on the other Titan. I mean, that's what they get for having a fragile Absolutely, and you can rack up a lot of points taking down the little grunts there. And uh, now you see, the really the that's a Now you see this. Oh, there's another raffle. We'll be right back.
We'll be partnering up with the Microsoft Store at this event, Pop Culture Expo. We're going to have old school games, Xbox One, Xbox 360, $2,000 in video game tournaments, everything from uh, other companies' games to Street Fighter and Marvel and uh, all kinds of stuff. So check us out. It's Memorial Day weekend. And uh, thank you very much. I really appreciate you letting us be here. Uh, if you want your friends at home, you can go to twitch.tv slash gameunderground. We're playing live right now. You see the stream over there. Uh, you can check out, if you're in one of the setups, you can be live, online, playing the game. So uh, please tweet, Facebook share, get our uh, twitch.tv slash gameunderground. Right the Guys, thank you very much. They're a stream regular. That's uh, some old rap. He watches streams all the time. I think he might be our, one of our mods even. Maybe not. Oh, like, that might be John Christensen. Who's in these? Talk to Ed. Ed, All right, so ask, the ask, winner for the Nyko charging base. You all haven't seen this. It's pretty fantastic. Let's take a look for her. Who's this? The winner will have the number six three three one nine six. Oh, no. six two off. Two off. Six three three one nine six. Thank God, I don't own controllers. They went home. I have a. I have a. Do we have? I already have a micro charger for my three sixty. It's not just a bunch of white guys, so it's, Boy, that was nice of them to put in. Especially the pilots who definitely want a women would make sense. Women are better at driving than men. Anyway, before I find somebody, let's keep going here down to this uh, new map I haven't actually seen yet. Going through the cabin system here, taking out some looks like a truck behind, uh, behind that truck there, that, that Halo Warthog looking vehicle. And uh, just blowing away some people left and right, taking, uh, taking out all these grunts. Uh, making good use of the carbine, uh, not touching the grenades just yet. Uh, taking a little stealthy approach around corners. And uh, I'm waiting for him to do some parkour to jump around, but it looks like he's getting yeah, it's, uh, it's not just in the game as much as people play it so far. I want to see way more parkour than I've seen so far tonight. I think the idea of jumping off a roof to attack a giant robot like appeals to me on a massive scale. I think I think it turns people off initially because if you do that in a, in a regular corridor cover shooter like Call of Duty Gears of War, if you jump out in the open like that, you're dead. Yeah. There's no two ways about it. But in a game like this, with such a cool environment with so many things going on, it is, is a good tactic to get around quickly. And a lot of times people don't look up, at least not yet. People are not covering themselves from, uh, from the top. They're looking at the corridors, they're looking around, they're looking to the left and the right, they're looking down, they're not looking up. Well, I, I really think it's good to think that they have this level assigned to support that's kind of like the right. 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 They're able to work with both like a little bit of help and those kind of jobs, as well as a giant and a half. I was one of the four people who was excited for Green Point came out. So like, I really like to see how some of these guys make these beautifully designed levels that we have. And most of the players, even if they're trying to play it safe, they are using some of the new helmets. You see that guy sniping from the top of the building. Again, most of those guys aren't even looking up there. They'll see the bullets hitting them. They're looking around to the left or right. They're not looking up. Right. 
So starting off inside a little yep. warehouse here, you can probably double jump over that crate if you wanted to, but he's gonna go downstairs oh, instead. Oh, well, that's all right. Uh, looks like, oh, no. I don't know what that was all about. Just uh, hanging out next to a, a grunt. Fans in the chat are not, uh, not big fans of the music, but that's okay. Uh, I, I gotta be honest, it's gonna be very loud. I don't entirely blame them. It's pretty loud. It'd be nice if we had a sound over something. Good call, right now. Oh, I got the anti titan away. Yeah, so now he's using the anti -tank, uh, titan uh, rocket, which is what you do. There's no chance to use it most of the gun, and uh, grenades, not so much either. So you really want to switch that and switch that. Um, I thought it was weird that the button you used to select that is the same button you used to get rid of it. You put, uh, you use left on the D-pad to select it, and you have to press X to go back to your main weapon, which I thought was a little Tech odd. Tech fixed all you pilots. We're crashing the terrorists. They're barely putting up a fight. Whatever you're doing, it's working. Keep it up. He jumps around and gets away, but uh, you can kind of see those guys making shots in the car, trying to take that away there. And, uh, I mean, it's, I mean, it's, it's a mass hard. chaos. You can yeah. see how chaotic this game is, how much is going on. Bullets flying in every direction. It follows hard, you guys. <laughs> The guy in front of me here is Danton, he's doing a really good job. He's, he's absolutely good. Yeah, oh no, he's hopping. I'm just gonna get a shot here. That's too bad. He's doing a good weapon. He's doing a good weapon. Oh yo, it's an ogre though! Yep, so it's ogre time. He's got that cannon there, and you'll watch him take it down those grunts. No problem at all. I'll see if he can punch some people. Otherwise, he'll run through the hot room. He opens that door. He opens that door. He opens that door. He opens that uh, pilot locks. Somebody shoots the, uh, the, the rocket at him. He did move out of the way quickly. I think he did take the hit, though. And uh, now there's two fighters in the boat. Recommend three jets. There he is, running around the ground. Let's see if he's going to do that again. I guess you could definitely have to kill all your guys who are beating the maneuver and like the guys. Yeah, the Titans don't have the same mobility. They really, uh, they, they're so super powerful, but against these guys, you can hide behind corners and get the rock. Even if you walk around, you can see the, uh, the, the weight with which they move a lot of people don't realize that the Titans have a dash that can yes, be used in any absolutely. direction. Absolutely. Yeah, you, I was dashing know. backwards. I you, thought it was yeah, interesting. Yeah, you can hold back and hit A and you'll get out of line of sight. Oh, that's very useful. Yeah, a and lot, a lot of, of people guys don't notice out. the rodeo. When somebody goes to the rodeo, a lot of people aren't noticing the guys on there until they get the eject button. Until yeah, it's too late. Yeah, I'm going to the middle here at the top, yeah. slowly going down. So let's see what he does this time. He's getting out the uh, the over again. He's, he's, like, he's just like yeah. laboring steps to see how slow he's going. Now he's going to the back of the car. He's going for the long shot with the cannon. There's two Titans over there. He's going to take him out. But uh, he might need to get a little bit closer. Here come the Sidewinders. Uh, well, he, he's, uh, I don't even know if they know. He's there. He's just like a bunch of them. shots. Yeah, right now they see him. They're fucking oh, yeah, 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 there he goes. And there he goes. Yeah. Down he goes. And boom goes to the dynamite. And it is just a long range Titan fight. You can see the chaos Titan exploding. Shields are people going nuts. The battle's almost over. Oh my god, that's insane. It, this is the fantastic. I feel like uh, a fire. This game just like switches back and forth between being a uh, a uh, like a mech warrior game and FPS. I mean, it really does seem like sometimes it's sensory overload. It's hard to keep track of all the stuff going on. What's going on in your Titan? Now he's getting the rocket. The rocket. See if we can take that guy down. I don't know what that flashlight's all about. It looks like a, a the rocket oh, wire, but did not detonate. Ah, I was hoping they were trying to bring down the robot with a flashlight. That's it. Imperial Guard style. Won't give away here the store. Six three three one three three. We can only hope. <laughs> No signal. Be advised. Your replacement time will be ready in nope. 15 seconds. None of us. Oh, one away. One away. One away. Replacement time is online. Take six tools. Oh, he's just rolling. Got some Weisenheimers here claiming the prize early. No one has ever made that joke before. Give away an Xbox uh, headset for the Xbox One, valued at eighty dollars. No claiming just yet. They're going for another number. I don't know why I'm commenting this, but I'll do it anyway because the mic's still on. He's like, man, I didn't even have to work out. I love making an Xbox avatar for FIFA. I'm kind of hoping I'll walk away with a, an Xbox One or a game or something. Six three three two zero seven. Hey, we have a winner. Lucky win.
winner of an Xbox One headset value to $80 for the Xbox Live, and hopefully he has. If not, that's going straight to GameStop. Going back to back with another drawing here. Titanfall headset. That's definitely going to get some eyes on. People are definitely going to want that. $160. I can't tell if it's a Turtle Beach from here. Looks like a uh, looks like a brand name of sorts. Are we ready? Everyone's ready. They're about to draw the numbers. I'm looking at my ticket. Nobody here. Two, oh, we got a winner. And we have a winner. You come up here, you Congratulations to that lucky man, his inevitable eBay purchase. Wow. Oh, it's a lady, never mind. <laughs> inevitable. <laughs> she will look quite styling in those. Right? Yeah, it's going to be the last one to get wet. Oh, yeah, of course it is. I'm just going to fart on all of them. I'm going to be straight up honest. As long as you don't do it with this stuff, that's great. I don't know. Microsoft Office. No! Sean. And uh, I guess we can keep uh, going with this if they're not going to blow up our spot with the. Uh, we don't want to leave. Oh, don't leave, though. We'll never get you flask if you leave. Yeah, it looks like we're going back to the music for now. Oh, I like that it gets louder every time they turn it back on. <laughs> Shout out to my ears tomorrow, which I won't be able to use. Shout out to the Microsoft guy who's turning each can of the visual face out. Oh, that's pretty good. No, I'm serious. He's turning each can. That is commitment. That, that is Microsoft good. commitment. Yes. That is, uh, that is excellent in action. I like you read about it. All right, well, we're going to get into another game up ahead. Uh, we're going to get another new arena, I think. Or no, no, did we see this one before? Nope, this, I believe, is a new uh, a new uh, location we're going to be playing in. We're getting uh, we're getting people who are really serious now. People want to win that Xbox one. Give me a favor. Yeah, absolutely. I'm going to go to the bathroom. Good call. If I get called, claim something for me. Will do. I'm trusting you. Uh, Ted, do you want to jump in on commentary while I uh, go uh, visit the little girl's room? All right, putting you on the spot. Hey, jump in, buddy. There you go. All right, I'm going to be joined by uh, Ted, uh, a.k.a. the Tedster. On yeah. There you go. And we're going to be uh, calling more time. Uh, how much of this game are you familiar with? I'm familiar with uh, a lot. I actually played the beta for a week. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, so um, the game is a lot of fun. There was a couple, there was a couple balance issues that were happening in regards to people being able to jump around with the walls and I think they figured all that out. They actually made people jump a little bit less often, a little bit less secure with the wall jumps. Oh, I see. I think they fixed it in the Xbox 360 version and with a patch on the PC. Okay, cool. I mean, it definitely looks pretty polished at this point from my, uh, my lamest perspective, but it's good to hear from someone that can make the game. Yeah, I mean, when you play this game, you have to realize that I'm a big League of Legends player, so uh, all of the all of the grunts and all the NPC control units are essentially like uh, like minions in League of Legends. The more you kill, the better off. Yeah. The more you kill, the better off your army is. Oh, it's, it's a Sean on the stream. Yeah, Sean's on the stream right now. Okay, so right Candy now. the Angel playing again, so we're going to probably see if we can here. That was incredible. Wow, sorry to cut you off there, but a guy was oh, blown out of the air with a grenade. He's looking around. He's, I think he's really check, checking his mini-map, which is a great battlefield depression. He knows what he's doing essentially from the start. He sees if there's some enemies coming up. Looks like they're NPCs because they're shooting like shit, but he got caught by PC. Right. Uh, it's, it's like it's, I hadn't made the connection, but it actually is pretty uh, like a MOBA game almost where you have the guys you can feed off. Yeah. Is there, is there any uh, benefit to killing them or just like playing No, that's the score. It oh, actually really? it actually lowers the amount of time that it takes for your Titan to come too. Oh wow, the, that's very the better good. Your, the better your kill rate, the faster your Titan comes. So. I can picture this game being really cool if uh, we're kind of in a random environment here where people are just walking up and playing, but I could see like really cool hardcore teams doing some interesting things to kind of coordinate, like killing those guys, getting yeah. benefits from it. Really cool swarm strategies that can be done. Yeah. Yeah. Well, this definitely seems like it's going to be pretty sweet. Once again, many platforms of the metagame is out in a few weeks' time. Yeah. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing more kind of competitive action out of this play. Uh, so once again, uh, we got Andy on screen for uh, those of you who are enjoying his previous games up here or scrolling in the chat room. Uh, <laughs> either or. So uh, we're going to be back to tell you how far we're going. Yeah. Crazy 
stuff. He's just walking around, pretty much killing people. You know that a team is losing when the opposite team only has 10. He is down. He's getting mowed down. We got another round. We got another round. I'm checking my card right now. 137.
Whoa! Cloak yeah, so on landing. That going was for sick. a cloak. You have the, uh, the active camo here. Well, John knows he's on the screen. I wouldn't well. be the right one. This was for our benefit. He's doing all the style points yeah. here. Going through the uh, unoccupied corridors. You find a lot of nothing when you leave the open areas, and that can be good if you're trying to sneak up on people. But if you're looking for action, you want to stay out in the open, maybe hide behind some things, and uh, not go too far into the shadows. And you have to be trolling us with the volume of this music at this point. Uh, I hope you guys can still hear us, because I, I, I apologize if I'm killing any of here, but it's literally, uh, like, definitely live here next to the Yeah, if you can't hear us, or if you have a problem with the chat, just uh, send a message and let us know. Otherwise, we'll keep talking like, uh, like jerks. Yeah, if we're streaming in your ear right now, it's because we're compensating. If it's not working, uh, we will definitely stop streaming in your ear. Anywho, so now the epilogue's up because uh, he won. So you gotta go destroy all the other pilots and uh, kill the ones fleeing to their dropship and take out the dropship if you can. I can't just manage to do that, so it looks like it's gonna be uh, uh, a. Actually, but he does have some resistance. There's a wall on the way, there's another Titan. There's a Titan over there, and it's gonna come down. And uh, it looks like this is a uh, bad time. He's gonna have the eject soon, probably now ish. Uh, uh, okay, uh, there he goes. Yep, and the interceptor is over there, but it uh, looks like he's gonna run out of time. Yeah, yeah, he's gonna there, go for the last kill if he can get it, and that's it. Militia forces are boarding their dropship. And it looks like they're getting piles of the, the game ready over here. You can kind of see them in. Get boxed. Get them all up, getting boxes and boxes. Oh, well, people are excited. I'd be surprised. I hope my Dark Souls is in there. I think I might actually see it, because it's a metal tin. When was it released? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was next week. No. Oh, I'm a fool. No, Dark Souls is this week, and then PC it comes out April 25th. And honestly, I might buy it on Xbox first, then buy it later on PC. Oh, yeah. guys. I wouldn't blame you. you uh, I am a fool. I thought it came out next week. Extra oh, nice. Nice. Oh, yeah. 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 So, uh, oh, they got a lot of people, and they just want to get out of the way. He's ready. Nice. Ah. Yeah, let's go, guys.
my god, the music gets louder every time. Oh, yeah. oh, okay, well, if you can still hear us, uh, we have... Oh, no guns! No guns, Robin! No uh, guns. We've got Candy playing another game here. He fiddled with his Leia, his, uh, sorry, his loadout. That used to be a nice car. Not anymore. Not anymore. That sends a Fire Nation attack. Oh, you and your Fire Nation. Oh, me and my... I haven't made one attack on Titan jokes yet. You're already going with Avatar. Well, I've made several attacks on Titan jokes. Because oh. I'm very original, I'm sure no one has made them yet. <laughs> I would give an Armin a leg to have that oh, type of wit. Oh, no. Full Metal Alchemist. <laughs> that didn't that didn't go anywhere. That was a that was a dead end if I ever heard one. Wow. Yeah, I got roped in with the, one of the Microsoft guys to enter to win a trip to E3, so oh, all I had to do is give them my throwaway email address, and I'm happy to do. I love trips and prizes and email. So going back to this game, we got some uh speaking of trips or Titan Spawn in this game. Yep, so I, I honestly I'm not seeing too much of uh, upward mobility with uh, the, the jetpacks and whatnot right now, which is a little bit of a disappointment. I'd like to see more of that instead of just hammering uh, grunts who aren't fighting back for some reason. You know, I I'm sure in an update they will step up the AI a little bit. I'm sure they want to keep it low for the beginning of the game to get people situated, but there will be an upgrade that uh, that makes the grunts a little bit tougher, because right now they really are kind of Yeah, we, I was just talking with uh, Ted while you were uh, while you stepped out, and uh, he was saying that he played a little bit during the beta, and there's definitely been a lot of patches for balancing and stuff like that. I'm sure within the, uh, the first few weeks of games out, we're going to see the meta evolve, we're going to see the patches take place and make everything very balanced, and uh, I think we're going to definitely see a really cool teammate come out evolving around both the AI and the uh, NPC characters and around the, uh, the, the Titan interactions. And the, oh yeah, and I'm and sure... Oh! Uh, oh, get wrecked! Oh, back attack! Get and I'm sure they've learned a lot from the beta, yes, and uh, not to that way. And that's, uh, that guy's just in invincible and hanging out, I guess? Alright, see you later. They've, they've probably learned a lot from the beta and from having people play so far, but the game is definitely going to change. Uh, in, in a lot of dynamic ways, and Keep once people up. start playing oh, yo. competitively, how many of their more in this game are the wall running? Uh, scrambled by a Titan there. Yeah, yeah but I'm curious to see how much of the wall running and the special people are specifically. Yeah. If it's all the time, or if it ends up being played more like a Call of Duty, and those uh, those features don't get used as much. And one thing I find interesting is that the Titans have their own set of They can't really go into the buildings, they can't destroy everything, which you think would be a bad thing. But it kind of pushes the boundary between where the Titans can go and where the people can go. It sets them as two different types of characters in the same game. Because you don't want the Titans to be overpowered just stopping everything. But in a battle, in a in Titanfall 2, I would love to see that mechanic. The Titans just destroying everything, everything breakable. It would really add another element of just utter chaos. Up in this game too, this uh, screaming round here. We've got, uh, let's get a uh, candy from our store, Game Underground, Root Town West, Screaming at Massachusetts, Lucky Road, Lucky Road. We're here at the Microsoft Store, the Aiden Mall. We're experiencing these guys, we've got a great game going on with the one of our own. Uh, right now, Candy is playing, for, I guess, the IMC team. They're falling a little bit behind nice Felicia, move. but uh, definitely doing his best. He's had a number of kills in this game, so hopefully we'll catch up pretty soon. Yeah, actually, they're only, uh, oh no, actually, still playing off. Never mind. Let me tell you, Tom. I can't. It is hard to talk about this game for three hours straight. It really is. I am uh, tripping over my words at this point. This has been a, a very long time. I do commentary for a wrestling night every uh, every week on Monday, but uh, in addition to not knowing a ton about this game, I also have been playing for some games about the same times I can This is over and coming. A boom goes down to my situation. We're just going to start slowing our words and going to utter nonsense. Absolutely. Uh, we may try out other languages and make up a few languages at some point. You know, there's only one language that people care about in this stream, Ryan, and that is death. Death destruction with titans and falling and guns. Listen, no one's making it to what we're saying anyway. They're giant robots. That's right. More like shut up and notice the robots. Speaking of giant robots, I'm going to go watch the research. Anybody remember Zoids? No, Zoids was the hype. I love Zoids. Zoids is the best. Now, did you see the one that had the giant war or the one that was like the competition? I like the giant cat monster. That one was pretty Oh, the Liger Zero? Liger Zero. The white one, yeah. yeah. That was a fun one. It got all kinds of different armor and crazy stuff. Yeah, it was the Jushin Thunder Liger of Zoids. Do you remember the three oh, forms? Oh, he's trying to melee kill here, but uh, uh, he got away. Sean would be pretty pissed if he found out we were talking about Zoids while he was playing. Nah, that's fine. Yeah, the Liger Zero, Jaeger, Panzer, and, um, and Schneider. Schneider oh, was the blade, right, Jaeger Schneider. was the uh, the fast one, and Panzer was the tank. I remember this now. Oh, yeah, the tank was the tank. Oh, that was a dumb show, but I loved it. And I used to just mowing down those grunts, taking a surprising amount of bullets, but not fighting back in the least. 
Right. As with Zoids, I'd like to remind you guys that we are the leading show right now to uh, the Kofi Oko season that's happening in Minneapolis. We've got the upper hand for now, but <laughs> it's a close fight. Then we'll jump on for some reboot. Oh my god, it's going to be great. Advise, You're not down with reboot, you get the hell out of this story. Yeah, you get the hell out. Mega Knight is the greatest villain outside of Moriarty in all of fiction. And it's time for more raffle actions. You probably can't hear us again. Yep. Oh, they're down the wire here. Oh, oh, prize of the day. Including the illustrious x -Men. This will be the remaining headsets that they have in stock at the store being deployed right now. Oh, you're trying to play right now. Sony action can Sony! Interesting choice. Timba! But it is essentially like a GoPro, so that is a nice prize. Acknowledge. Stand by for time to fall. It's like a it's like a Sony GoPro. AI offline. Pilot mode engaged. Oh, I believe that the, uh, yep. I think you are probably the reason you guys went from being in a 10 point deficit to yep. bordering them by 25 points. Absolutely. Yeah. 
That was the I love that. There was uh, there was human viscera all over the battlefield. Blood, guts, carnage, and robot. No, MVP, MVP can't be the angel in that game, absolutely. AKA so Community 452. The music is awful and ripping my brain apart. I convince it gets louder after every raffle. What? An orgy of sound? So it looks like the last two prizes of the night, if I had to guess, are going to be... Of ear fucking. I, look, I think the last two prizes of the night, if I had to guess, are going to be that sound bar they just walked past with and uh, possibly an X-Ball. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they're definitely giving away at least one Xbox One tonight. Uh, not to be confused with the original Xbox, as the, the new system just came out. Uh, Game Underground, we might be able to give out the original Xbox. By the way, in case you don't know, Game Underground, the store from, we sell retro games there. Uh, That's right, sell they sell Sega Genesis, yeah, NES, GBA, DS, 3DS, Xbox Original, PlayStation 2, PlayStation 1, N64, and anything else I forgot, Sega CD, 32X. 3DO, Panasonic CDI, Atari. We got, we got some uh, we got some Atari Toys and Thunder stuff, yeah. Oh, yeah, you do? We had a 3DO briefly. It's gone now, though. Yeah. I, uh, I like to troll around for 32X games because nobody else wants them, and Sega Genesis games because I love them. Actually, yeah, no, it's a, it's a really cool place. It's a place you can hang out. We got an arcade. Uh, we do screen rentals. Uh, it's Route 9 West, Route 51 West Road, Game Underground's name of the store. We got business cards here. We have a website. Uh, sorry, we have a Facebook page. We have a website. Don't go there. Go go to the, go to the Facebook page. It's better. Uh, Facebook.com, Game Underground. Look for the green warp pipe logo. Um, or uh, check our sweet Yelp action. We are now like a four plus star Yelp store. We got a nice. And if you're going to Anime Boston, look out for us there. I Absolutely. will be there dancing in a Pikachu suit. Oh, uh, Bandai's love your Pikachu games. suit. Yeah, we, got, we got the uh, the Pikachu suit at Anime Boss, and we got Paxis coming up. We're going to be there as well. We're going to uh, have some gonna good be games at, uh, there, some good SNES Nintendo, uh, games, some good N64 games. Yep. All kinds of good stuff going out to all those tournaments and, uh, yep. and uh, appearances. Definitely check it out. What kind of what is that? What, what, what? What are those looting instruments? Uh, which event? Uh, what, 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 what are those events? Oh, the, uh, the, the uh, Yoko? Yeah. Yeah. What were you going for? I'm gonna wait for the line to die down. Uh, I feel that I butchered that joke by not thinking about that. I think you set up. It wasn't like I missed the pitch. It was like uh, Evan, you set up a T-ball on the little backboard on the team. And uh, God, I swung at it, but uh, they said it was a good try. I went back to the bench, made some orange slices. Uh, I did not. I did not. Uh, any case, he struck out there. Um, if, if you're referring to the uh, the uh, the AG thing, I don't think we pronounced that yet. So I just feel sort of. I just want to say it like on the screen. The what? Uh, exactly. The what? What was that? Uh, we're not saying anything about that. All right. So here we have a little girl trying to figure out how a pistol works. Oh, fantastic! Oh yeah, young player here at the, uh, the Microsoft store. As we're about to be drowned out by another raffle again. Now this would be a lot more exciting if you guys were here. Come on, you. All five of you.
Jump him! <laughs> he is currently leaving the building unarmed. <laughs> Unattended. <laughs> On his own. A surface tablet. No other than the Titanfall Xbox One yeah. Edition console. Woo! Who won this one day? Who would not want to take this home? $500 value. Copy of Titanfall included. Oh I told you. <laughs> Why do I die? No. I pre ordered it, but I was like, I'm pretty sure they're doing a game with me. Dark Souls 13 knows. I didn't know that. I have no money. Shut up. I'm so sure if you were that in the second time you got in. Oh. 63. I don't get a chance to break. She's going to say 2. 7. 1. Press S 
to eject from that site? Oh, he did it. Be advised, your titan has been eliminated. Oh, looks like they're evacuating here. guys uh no commentary for the last like round or so but uh it's late in the night we have been talking all evening and i can't hear anymore as you know so still the only ones still the only ones though oh we've reached the end oh there we go there we that's us we reached the end what logo those guys have and switch is blowing up titanfall right now oh well, no we're the only ones Pumping your fist and turn the music down like 17. Oh my god. Hey, have a good night, man. Uh, so we're gonna go into another game here. Uh, I will do my best to stop itching about the music and actually just call the game right. Uh, we have... Uh, I think the same teams from last time, so the same players who were the last game are gonna be playing right now. In the GCW Microsoft Arena, we are summoning snakes! I can actually hear you now better. With, with my fingers in my ears. Oh shit! That's amazing. Y'all cowards don't even have gym badges. You so see now. their best in 2013? Yeah, I watched the entire thing last night. I fell asleep on being twice, but it's great. It's a good call, though. No. I was like, ah, I'll watch it for like a second, then I ended up watching the entire thing. Dude, people are going so nuts with that mailbag, the stuff they get in the mail is crazy. Yeah. I was like, boy, this makes my cereal game look like a bunch of crap. So, did you see the uh, the accents that are back on it? Yeah. Like, oh my god. And the plushies they got was great. Yeah. Oh. I almost won them. I, yeah, I got, we gotta try the YouTube channel so we can get real today, right? I would totally buy a wolf. Yeah, I would. Or at least. This is a battle of attrition, pilot. Target and destroy all enemy forces. Uh, yeah, get it. I'll play later. Okay, yeah, yes, you know, sure. One left, go, you go. Oh. Ah. I'm sure once everyone leaves, fight this one easy. That's probably what's going to happen, though. We're going to be like, stop making fun of our music on your screen. It is, it is late, guys, but we're going to keep streaming some Titans falling. It is good for me, makes it look like I have no hair. Oh, no. I'm going to I hope I don't have pets in Oh, no, you know. <laughs> I'm glad you're just saying. If not, yeah. I'll just kill myself. You have cool guy hair. It's awesome. awesome. Cool guy hair. You do. I don't it's have awesome. dreads, so I need You do need woolly dreads, they're great. Well, I need fishy Liam hair. You yeah. have fishy Liam hair. I currently do, I need to hear it. I do have fishy Liam hair right now, though. I'm not giving up on We're talking, yeah. We're talking hey guys, you can't see us? You want to hear more about our hair? Yeah. Yeah. Let's no. talk more about the YouTube yeah. channels we yeah. like. That'll be great. We got it. Alright, I'm gonna let Evan get in my commentary right now because I am myself in there. Alright, take over, Evan. Unlike this guy. I am not a complete wimp, so, uh, and I've actually played first one cheers before, uh, 
played a lot of Counter Strike Source in uh, various leagues, ESEA and all that, so uh, I'm interested to see another FPS out there, you know? And since we're the only one streaming on Twitch, uh, I figure I might as well. Bless you. Oh, there's keys in here. I'll just give you a poke there, and it is successful. Be able to blindside him there. A lot of people use the Good tactic. It's, uh, it's actually pretty hard to see unless you're right up next to him. And you can get some decent uh, movement. It's really good for moving across the map quickly. Now, I don't really know anything about uh, Titanfall. Okay. I know uh, it seems to feel like Call of Duty. Uh, and it, it's much more open, much more chaotic. It's really interesting. Uh, I would like it to go to a battlefield with only one type of vehicle in a smaller space. But it's, it's been really fun. I played it a couple times. It, it seems uh, it seems interesting that they give it so... It seems they really want to use the moving mechanics, but they don't give you a map that, oh, that's designed for it, it feels like. I don't know. other in mechs and let me tell you the energy here has been completely electric magnetic psychomatic psycho energy too much for some people to handle <laughs> too much like that if you're out of your shield. So it definitely adds some uh, mobility to the otherwise so tight. Nice, uh, nice jump kick there. I put it twice and I nailed it something like that. All right, let's get out of this. Uh, just looking at a line right now. It's kind of crazy. Uh, it looks like the DJ is backing up. Take knowledge. Stand by the Titan Ball. Here, uh, we're, we're trying. I think we're gonna start packing up so that we're not staying here until uh, one, one or two in the morning. Packing up. Things are winding down. People are getting their game. Keep playing or going. Use the pressure to collect the trees. Start packing. Tech six gold units. Tech six gold units. We've been defeated. Sweet, sweet taste We're cutting our losses and getting the hell out of here. Indeed. Mission all set. Proceed to nearest evac. Uh, this game was pretty interesting. I'll uh, give it a further <laughs> shot. What a jump kick, man. That was a fun melee. That was better than just a melee. What is that? I have played it a bit on the PC at home. Uh, not a lot. It seems like it's going to be a decent pickup if you're into this kind of thing. Uh, I sort of am. Undecided right now. On the fence. You know, more played some more. I'll tell you this more. I have Dropship will not wait to pass in the departure. Recommend proceeding to the back point. I played all the cards a little bit, but I never got super competitive. I played this game, it's very accessible. 
comfortable, it's easy to get into, and it's, it's hard to master. And that's what I really like about playing it a couple times. I will definitely be checking it out again either on PC, or probably on PC, maybe on Xbox One if I can uh, get a deal or somebody gives it to me. But uh, definitely check this one out. Um, it should be all everywhere. It's going to be most, one of the most highly anticipated games this year. Uh, definitely, definitely, if you can play it, play it. And if you want to play it at Game Underground, we will have copies available if you want to come and rent a screen. It's uh, pretty cheap, $6 for an hour, 15 all day, 10 for two. And you can come to Game Underground and give the game a try here. If uh, you want to try it out before you buy it, it's pretty cheap and uh, you'll get to play online. We got the whole setup there. So uh, come by to, to Game Underground. And I also recommend Killer Instinct for the Xbox One if you're coming by. Um, one of the hypest fighting games I've ever played. Absolutely phenomenal. And uh, I'm not even a really big fighting game fan, to be, honest, <laughs> yeah. to, be, uh, to be fair. But it's a phenomenal game. And now we're back at Lion Cam 2014. Yeah, waiting. No one's playing right now. Uh, everybody's kind of waiting to uh, waiting in line to get their playing. game. You know, the hypest line on Twitch. Absolutely. You know, if there's one thing we can say that we are an exclusive, uh, we're probably the exclusive to actually we're stream the, the line. line. For a, a lot of Titanfall. places going to give you some hard hitting Titanfall action. We're going to give you Jamie drinking a soda in front of the cam and the line. And he looks like he really enjoyed that. He's going back for another sip, uh, putting it down. Out. The he play out? by play. That's not the traditional pre-fight soda, though. That would have been the beginning of the match. And uh, now he's uh, oh, he's, he's he's plugging. He, he's shilling. He's shilling pretty hard. He's shilling pretty hard. And he's bringing up the Game Underground card. I've actually was just talking about the uh, this, the Game Underground uh, being able to play. Uh, to the right, or to the left. There you go. There you go. That's your teeth. I can see your teeth. <laughs> hey, look, Jamie. Look, look over there, Jamie. Look at the screen. <laughs> it's back in time. Yep. Anyway. Do you want to cut a hot GCW promo right now? We can do that. All right. Yeah, why don't you go play Titanfall? Give it a try. There's still some free screens, I think. Like I said, I have it at home on the PC. And, uh, okay. I might jump in again before we leave this time. Oh, there you are, trying to stick your face in the camera. Have a good one, Look at we're hugging on the street. Yeah, <laughs> live TV. <laughs> you can feel the love in the room tonight. And uh, I'm waiting for the line to die down to get my game, so we're going to see what Jamie has to say now. Do you think that we should keep it going for a few more minutes, or do you think we should sign off? There's not much going uh, there's on There's not now. much we going got, on, so we, we might as well uh, take it down. Yeah, sign off. Right. Yes, yeah, take us out. And now a word from Jamie, the illustrious owner of Game Underground, in all of his glory, to talk to you, the fine viewers of Twitch. All right, guys. Hey, I want to thank everybody out there for joining us live online on our uh, twitch.tv slash game underground, on youtube.com slash game underground store. Um, please let people know you had a good time at the uh, Xbox One Titanfall launch over here at the Microsoft store. We're going to be doing more stuff in the future with them. Uh, we're having a great, great time here working with Microsoft. They've been nothing but awesome. We've met a lot of new people. So uh, if I met you there, checking the stream out thank you for coming out i really appreciate it and for all of our uh, game underground fans that came out and uh supported this and also watched online thank you very much uh and that's all the time we got for tonight and jamie where could people Microsoft look for store. game underground to come soon to uh, uh local events and or uh places we do we do have a uh, pop culture expo coming up in may um it's uh memorial day weekend may 24th through the 25th uh we're doing street fighter smash brothers uh, Marvel vs. Capcom, Mario Kart, a whole bunch of other tournaments, $1,000 in cash prizes, $1,000 in uh, convention credit you can win. Uh, we're also doing lots of big events at our store, um, so make sure you're checking that stuff out. Now one last thing, remember every Monday night we're streaming WWE 2K14 live on this channel at this exact same time because we run late until like midnight. So make sure you check that out and everything else. We're doing Smash Brothers every Thursday night. And uh, you guys, thanks for joining us here at the Microsoft Store in the Natick Mall. And uh, you guys have a good night. Thanks for joining us on the stream. Thank you for tuning in, guys. Have a good night. Take care of yourselves.